Welcome to my channel, Living Linux. Today I want to show you how you can add the Arch user repository to the package manager. So I'm still struggling to get Waydroid working on my Pinebook Pro. And when I looked at the logs, I saw some errors about the clipboard. And here you can see that it is actually optional, but you do get a benign error message about it. But I was trying to install it, and that's when I noticed that I couldn't find it. So you can do this from the command line, but I prefer to use the graphical package manager. And for instance, when I search for Waydroid, it does show up and you can see that I already installed it. Now, when I search for Python by clip, well, you can see that I already installed it but probably when you search for it, it won't show up. And for instance, when I click on repositories, then it says no package found. So it's not in the, what they call the user repository or the, the community, sorry, the community repository, but it is in the Arch user repository. So here is some text that explains what the Arch user repository is. And sometimes this is just one phase in where users can add into a separate repository on Arch Linux. And perhaps in the future, when it's, let's just say, quite popular and when they also can find a maintainer for it, then it can be, you could say, upgraded to the community repository. Now, by default, the Arch user repository or AUR, it's not activated by default. So you can go to the preferences. Go to third party. And here you can enable AUR support. You don't necessarily need to keep the built packages. Um, this can be handy when you want to roll back to an earlier version. I enable check for updates and also check for development packages updates. And that should be it. So when we close this, now you can see that there's also AUR here. So when I click here, then you can see that it is in the AUR and that you can easily install it just from the graphical package manager. And for instance, I was also interested in installing the PlayStation Portable emulator, PPSSPP. And with some of the other emulators, for instance, like Stella, the Atari 2600 emulator, that is in the official community repository. But for instance, when I look for PPSSPP, it's not in the community repository, but it is available in the user repository. So now I have to figure out what I need to install, if I have to install all of these or 
just some of them and when you want to know more about PPSSPP I will put the link in the description so to recap I still have some problems installing Waidroid and apparently it is working on the Pine phone but so far I haven't seen anyone that has it working on the Pinebook Pro but hopefully we will get there soon and enabling the Arch user repository will also enable you to find more software that you can install so that's all for today and I hope to see you again in my next video